hello guys last time i have uploaded the video about the core ui implementation of the theme with angular 4 so i am getting a questions on this like uh, how to implement the how to change the login fun uh, change the routing functionality like uh, it should redirect to the dashboard after user logins so uh, in this tutorial i am covering those questions and uh, i will try to make you understand the basic architecture of this theme and the routing architecture okay so i have opened the two editors here first for the default and the second one the implementation which i have made so now let's try to understand the architecture of this thing so 5000 port this is the default implementation of theme and on, on 4200 port I have changed the code for the functionality which is required so you can see here it is redirected to the login page and the default implementation will re redirect to the dashboard okay so first of all let's understand this routing architecture this theme is implemented with the parent child routing with lazy loading of the modules so basically two parts full layout and simple layout full layout includes the menu like uh, top navigation left navigation a simple layout doesn't require any menu like pages like let me show you page pages like login register it doesn't require any top or left menu navigation okay so so this is the simple layout now whenever application starts it will redirect to the dashboard so this is the default routing architecture now whenever you want to access the these modules these are the parent parent modules you can see here this is component module so inside component module you will also find the child and its routing so you can see here this is component model and this is its child components like buttons social buttons so you can see here this is component and its routing so now let's try to change this dashboard to pages okay so now when url is empty it will redirect to the pages but now what is pages pages is nothing but this is the url part now whenever it redirects to the pages it is null so let's check the p uh, routing in the pages module now you can see here there is no default routing here so let's implement the default routing here let me just copy the paste code here now after pages module we want to redirect to the login component okay so let me just put the login keyword here now it should recompile and refresh the page now refresh the page okay 
as you can see here it will always redirect it to the login page so this is the changes which i have made now second question how to redirect the user after the login page let me show you the impl implementation which i have made so this is the uh, routing of the app module main module now let me show you the login component this is the login component this is the login form i have put simple validate user function here and we can see validate function validate user and the one service to validate the user now whenever you click on login this function will check whether the user is logged in or not here i have implemented that uh, implemented static code you can call uh, web api here to check whether the user is valid or not so this will return true or false so if it is true that means the user is valid so we we will redirect the user to the dashboard so this is the simple code for redirect after the login so now let me show you the implementation on the 4200 port so now when you type the username as a password and same as for the password admin username and password is admin when you log in see it will redirect to the login page so this is the basic implementation now there is one problem with this implementation so now this is the login page without login user should not be redirect to the uh, dashboard or any other page but in this implementation it will be direct to any page like dashboard or components models so you can see here user can access the modules or pages by entering the uh, module uh, url so uh, i am planning to make the another video on this you how you how you can prevent the user from from accessing the modules by url so i will be implemented uh, using uh, auth service and connective options so don't forget to watch the second part for this video okay so thanks for watching guys thank you